Travel Insights Southeast Asia presents a horror story, what was that entity? This story is recounted to me by one of my old secondary school classmates. I'm from Singapore it was before we parted ways at the end of grade 6 that he told me this story. It was during a time at night. As part of CO curricular activities, the head teachers spontaneously planned a night walk around the school. Apparently one of them had wanted to prank the students, hence he dressed up like that of a ghost and hid somewhere at the end of the classroom in line with the walking route. One by one participants had to take their turns to walk from one end of the school to the other end. As there were gossip everyone knew that probably a teacher would prank them by dressing as a ghost. That said participants form a line and started to begin the route, near to the classroom, they could see a figure draped in white clothing that was standing near the glass panels of the window. After the whole ordeal and night walk was over, many participants said they spotted two figures one was the teacher, while the other had black fangs long fingernails and was hovering above the teacher, the figure was hovering above the teacher who was conducting the prank, the students had shrugged it off and decided that it was another person conducting the prank. The teacher came back with his white clothes and announced his prank. Curious, they asked if he had an accomplice that accompanied him in his prank, but the teacher was insistent that he was the only one. After the incident, everyone had a feeling the school was haunted, but we didn't know what was that entity that night. After that many years, we got close to that answer. Meeting my secondary school classmate again after making this YouTube channel. Travel Insights C. I further clarified and asked further questions of what exactly happened that day, he recounted that that was when we noticed that the figure had a silhouette that resembled that of a female, it wasn't walking, it had a large smile. And when it passed a street lamp, we realized it was a not of this world a ghost that's said to be the soul of a dead person trapped in place and time. For some reason, we started researching behind the school history and we noticed it used to be a graveyard and execution ground. We looked at each other and quickly sip our drinks as I document this story for my YouTube viewers. Needless to say fresh with the story I created this podcast and hope you enjoy, like and subscribe.